Kiora, welcome to my happy place. If you like today's video, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment so I know that you've been, don't be shy, and please enjoy. Kiora, welcome to Waste Some Time with Maggie. I've come on to do a pick 10. I have just over my page. Just check them in the shop. Right. I'm going to pick out my 10. Let's give them a good mix around. Pick out my my 10. Get my bits and pieces together and go from there. Right, add a focal image. Excuse me, crunching. I have got a throat lozenger in my mouth. Add random numbers. Add torn paper. Add a quote. Use cut or torn shapes from a book. What's that? Two, four, five. Add random words. Oh. Doesn't look like they're going to be very kind to me today. Add gems. Add black or white. Add white gesso. Wow. Right, that's two. One more. Add a border. Right. Right. I, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I've got some book. Okay, I'm back. I just need to go and get a bottle of water to curtail my coughing fit. Right. Just um, make my book pages a little bit ready. While I was looking for bits and pieces, I've come up with a bit of an idea for my page. Which is good. Right, I'm just going to have some little strips of paper. What does it say? Torn or cut shapes. Mm, they have to be shapes. Well, anything is a shape, isn't it? As far as I'm concerned, so we've got some shapes, and we'll just put those over there. Let's make some some box shapes. Oh dear, oh dear, that was a big coughing fit. Didn't think I was going to stop. <coughs> I'll just have another sip of water. Right. Hopefully, we're okay now. Right, now, I went looking and I found some orangey paper, some purpley paper, and I've just printed off a um, some Halloween stuff from the Graphic Fairy, so I thought, well, since it's the 30th of October here, Almost Halloween that I would sort of base this on a Halloween page. <coughs> Just get some bits of paper to go down. I don't have a lot of purple, but there's a few bits of purple in here that we can use, which seem to be Halloween y colours. Halloween is not a really big thing in our country. More little ones are getting into it these days. Come around dressed up with their mums. Um, but get a lot of you know, adolescents that just want to come out and not dressed up but expect to get something. So... We don't actually do it anymore. We used to do it 
always have lollies for the kids, but these days there are so many different things, gluten-free, nut-free, that um, we don't bother about it anymore. We just close our, close our curtains and keep to ourselves. Alright, what we got here? Some bits of paper here. Just trying to get some that look a little bit. We can make some sort of a background in colour. I must say, not really big into Halloween. We'll put some bits of paper down and see what we can see what we can do. Maybe we'll go this way. Just um, lay a bit of a background down of sorts. Give ourselves a bit of colour around. Maybe it's a little bit like that in here. Put the side. So, um, sticks weren't all that kind to us, I didn't think. Right, I'll just put some down and see how we get on, basically. Oh dear. My sinuses are absolutely shocking at the moment now. I'm hoping that this will hold bits and pieces down. It's been very muggy here, so it's quite um, gluey and sticky. A little bit down here, I think. Just a little bit to go in there. Might do this bit at the top here. I hope I'm in shot. I'm still trying to get used to my glasses. My close up is a lot better. Um, but then when I look up, my um, <clears throat> focusing is a little bit off still and it um, tends to make me feel slightly nauseous. So it's a bit... Right. That's a bit of orange in here. I'll take that along that way there, I think. Right. I'm going to use wide license with these um, prompts today. Because you don't have to take them all literary. Literary. Whatever that word is. My tongue can't get around it today. Um. You know, you can, black and white doesn't have to be paint or gesso, it can be whatever you want it to be. So, put that bit there, and this little bit over here. So we've got, got a background down, and now we have to, Make it look. Just give another bit of. Always rip the wrong way. Just put this bit down up here. Yuck. Fingers are getting all gluey again. <coughs> right. Slip that there like that. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. Just 
through this bit in here. Just to fill it up a bit. Right. Got. So we've done our torn paper and our put a bit of book page on there and then we'll be have that done. Right. Just get our little bits and put them around. So, haven't been doing too much the last few days. I've really been sitting in the chair sleeping most of the time because I haven't been feeling all that well. But feeling a little bit better today, so I thought I'd come and do a video. I haven't been doing much lately. And bit down there and a bit over here right one more bit in here I think right it's looking like a hot mess it's we're going to add some white gesso, I think. It looks like the next thing to do, just to hopefully bring it all together. Just get a little wee, put a little bit on my palette. And then a little bit of spray water. Just to get it a little bit watery, so we don't want it to be too, um, <clears throat> right, now what do I want? I want a roller, I think. A little roller here, I don't know how good it is, but. Oops. it down a bit but hopefully make it look a little bit more cohesive right right I'm back I had to tidy up that because I've got white gesso everywhere typical of me um, right now Add random numbers. While I was at it, I found this paper piece with all numbers put on it through the stencil. So I thought that I would just um, add these because they were there and start using up my stuff. Because you start to get bits and pieces everywhere right just right add random numbers this is going to be my random numbers just going to pull it apart the bits Some bits around. With such shaky hands. Right. 
All right, one, two, three, four, five. That'll do us, I think. Right. A bit of plastic here. Now, what did I do with my... Here it is. Get out of the road. Glue these down. It's not looking too bad. And I'll just have this a little bit here, I think. Right. That's not too bad at all, I don't think. Now what? Random words now. Oh my goodness. Right. Right. I was having a look in my... Halloween stuff. And I've got all these black and white. That I could just put around as my words. Right, take that big trick and treat away and put this little one in, I think. And I think that, which is potion, can be my uh, random words. Now I think that I might need heavier glue for this. Oops, just threw my pen away. Just poke that in there so I don't poke myself, <coughs> which I do quite frequently. And put the right way around. Oh, that's not bad. got these sent in happy mail a long time ago so it's good to be able to use them right. anything else there oh I haven't done that one have I My eldest granddaughter's birthday next week she will be 11 i can't believe it she's gone went off for her great granddaughter that is um went off for her um intermediate visit for intermediate school which is year seven and eight Right, that's not looking too bad. Right, so we have put our random, oops, put our random words in. Let's keep these. I know what I've done and what I haven't done. Right, now we've got to add black and white. Well, we've added black and white with those as well, haven't we? Right. Now I have got, where did I put it? Over here. I have, I think it's um, breaking a bit, so I'm going to cut it down. I made this spider's web, so I must have done Halloween. I did think I did do a Halloween journal once. So I'm going to cut this 
down so it's in the right shape yeah, around about that'll do it's old and it's getting broken and I was just wondering if I can just get some black <coughs> let me see black spray I think might be that one and I've got some just to find it jet black right okay right I'm just gonna I don't want it to be heavy heavy just trying to stop it from going absolutely everywhere all right not great but not not too bad so we have added our black all right back now we've got to add some gems these here are just going to be glued on i think Now it's going, it's absolutely teeming down outside. Right, if any other little ones like that, yes we do, right. Just a couple of bits around. rained all night and it's been raining all morning well what is it yes about three o'clock or half past three that i can see there did i just no i didn't they're funny little gemmy thing these they aren't actually a gem they're sort of like a faux gem uh, yes, it's 3.28, so it has been raining most of the day. Right, we have added gems. You can see them there. Can we do one more? Oh, I guess so, why not? I have three. The even number would be better. No, won't waste all of that. Right, this time I think I'm just going to put my bit down on the, on the ground. Not that it's straight, but it will do. Not too much, but never mind. Let's see if we can hold that down for a minute. That glitter glue is pretty good. It, it holds most things. Right. I love my little storage containers. Whoops. Not quite enough down then, I don't think. Right. I moved it before it was dry. We've added gems. Now what have we got? Border, add a quote and a focal image. Right, I have got lots of little images here. And we've got, our, we've got a quote here somewhere, which I think I'm going to have down here. Everything is spooky on this night. We're going to have that there. Now I have got lots of little Halloween, colourful Halloween -y things. We have a little pumpkin. That's quite cute. I could have a raven. What else could we have? Hmm. 
don't like the white behind it. All right. It's not bad. It's a little bit, I don't know if you can see it, but it's actually purple behind it now. All right. And have some more little pumpkins around. looking pumpkin mat but hey it's a pumpkin it's a pumpkin all right quite like that Liking that. Let's see what else I've got here. Why not? Let's go all out. <coughs> right. Oh, a bit of plastic back. And we'll start with our pumpkin person. And I'm pretty sure I got all of these um, off the graphic theory. Liking that. So one can go about here. I think. Yeah. Let's go over this way a bit so we can still see part of our trick or treat. That's going to go over here. right off the edge of the page and this one is card so I'm going to put it down with my art glitter glue that needs a refilling I don't know I think I've got another one already full Right, so this is going to go be like that. Like that. This little one. Hmm. Why did I think that was two pieces? Well, it's a coffin, isn't it? That's what that is, a little coffin. You want a coffin? Right, we might just have the might just have the headstone. Just like that. We have a little witch on the broom. Whoops.
bit. Right now, I think just get my gesso back. I'm going to go here. I'm just going to add a little bit of white gesso around here. Just so he shows up a bit. Get my cloth. Just damp it down a bit so it's not quite so not quite so um, white. I'll just hold him in there. Yeah, just makes it look so he shows up a little bit. Down our skull and crossbones. Right. A little witch broom is not glued down. Okay. A little bit of clean off. It's covered it quite a bit. I can still see it, sort of. Now, do we want that there or I? got one other thing that I could put there instead. Let's have our, our moon. Hmm. It gives us a little bit of orange up the top there, doesn't it? I like that better, I think. Can be used on something else another time. Right. Let's just give this a little. Right, so we've got our quote. And we've got our focal, or our, our images, and now it is just add a border. It's my black body. I'm just going to dip in the water. to make it a little bit rungy. Grungy edge. Right. Just get a piece of punchinella. Just a little bit there. And I think we'll get our white gesso back. Now, what do I want? 
Alright. We just want to give it yes. Just a little bit of something in the background just to was a bit much. Let's see if I can just put that back on there and wipe it off a little bit. Yeah, that's better. Just give it a little bit of something else. Just a little bit around our yep. that there's my pick 10 Halloween page. I'm quite happy with it. I think it's back down. Right. The date today is the 30th. The 11th. Twenty-two. And that's a G Z Megs. And that's my page, and my desk is one heck of a mess, and that's not glued down properly. That just ripped your eye here. I think I need some silicon glue for this type of thing. Mind you, I must probably wiped it off with all that manhandling. Thank you for being with me, Kia Kaha, stay strong and I'll catch you again soon.